What is up, YouTube? It's Coffee or Prodigy back with another video. And today, we're going to be doing the first ever episode of Road to Jasper. First ever episode, technically. This is the first season we have Jaspers coming out. Technically, they're called Cosmic Jaspers. But most of the time, I'm just going to call them Jasper because that's way too long of a name. I don't feel like saying that every single time. But we're going to go ahead and type in our name. It's just going to be RTJ, like Run the Jewels. But yeah, let's go ahead and get right into here. Um, I checked before. There's no codes out. There's no way we can get like, a free car. Like, if we like started this like literally like a month ago, that's when the last code ended. It was like for Nicole Jokic, um, an all star card for back to back MVP. But unfortunately, we can't get that. But yeah, basically, what this series is as we uh load into here is us just trying to get to Jasper as quickly as possible. What, of course, without spending any, well, I guess it's not, of course, because I didn't say that before, but without spending any money whatsoever. So, this is going to be completely no money spent. But uh, yeah, we're going to be trying to do this. Um, the first theme apparently that we're going to be getting is going to be a journeyman theme. I'm starting this off on the uh saturday on the sunday before that comes out because i did want to like get like 500 power mark because you do have to get that before the um mini event so i want to like be able to jump into that right away so i'm trying to do that right now um which is why we're starting it on saturday instead of monday we usually start these on like, the first day of the events but we're not doing that um this time but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and play through these tutorials and we'll uh, get some of the stuff that we could do early on all right so fortunately we can actually skip the tutorial so that is what we end up doing um they want to select. I'm guessing this is where we get our amethyst. Tater. I did start like a what's name no money spent account earlier this year, but yeah, we got our amethyst Jason Tatum right there. He, of course, is going to be one of our best cards. Not with that really John Collins, it's probably going to be pretty useful as well. Um, we'll go ahead and throw Jason Tatum in there to replace Joe Harris, and then well, I guess they want to train him with the okay, they train, let's, let's train him with the sapphire thing because it would be nice to use that um other ruby card we got from that. All right, so yeah, um. So we're also getting this Shaq thing. Honestly, I don't think this Shaq thing is going to be useful. Usually by the time we get up to like this Shaq card, like we're already far uh, ahead. Um, we're also going to get these 100 coins. Not going to do it right now, but we are going to get these 100 coins. So that obviously we want to get a free 100 coins. We're obviously not spending any money. And then we don't, of course, have enough coins to buy that. So let's go look at these objectives. So for the daily objectives, we got this stuff, which we can, of course, get. we can definitely do all these things when two turning games like a three-point shot. All right. For the weekly objectives, it ends in 20 hours. So we have to do all this today. Um, but none of them look too complicated. A block a shot, claim the ad pack. We might not be, I'm pretty sure we won't be able to do that because there's not enough time left. And then the monthly stuff, we have five days to do this. So, um, looks like we could complete the monthly stuff, daily stuff, and the power cap stuff. I don't think we'll be able to complete because we need 3,500 power. I don't think we're going to be able to reach that for today. And then outside of that, is there any other stuff that we can claim real quick? Um, let's go up to the store. Let's go ahead and start off by claiming our freak pack because they do. Um, have a chance if you go look this. I guess it all oh, gave us ruby cards, but I thought for real, I thought they would give like the same words we get on our main account. But let me give us up to ruby cards, which still would be pretty useful if we are able to pull a card here. Fortunately, we don't. We get a um, what's the name, elite gear key. Um, outside of that, we have the top performers pack right here, which we are going to try to build up some coins so we can try to open up some type of uh pack. Um, what we'll probably end up doing is opening up this diamond pack right here so we can get ourselves a free diamond card. We just need 150 coins. We obviously get the 100 coins from that, um, what's the name, that linking account type of thing. And then the other one from, um, what's the name, just doing like the stat line. And then, uh, yeah, it's basically just, just, yeah, just doing like the stat line. And then like the free pack gives you like a coin or two every single time, up to four coins every single time. So we're going to be doing that. Yeah, I want to go ahead and uh, start uh, playing through this. I'm also going to, to connect my account. And I'll be back once we uh, finish doing up all that stuff and using them some of our stamps. We don't want to just sit in here right now. All right, so we are back. I did. Usually what we're going to do is when stuff happens off screen, I'm going to screenshot and I'll show you guys next time um, I get a chance. But something did just happen and I feel like they need to show it. I also, also want to talk about this because basically what ended up happening, we opened that free pack, of course. We got ourselves that Ruby card. Is there a... And the, I like I was trying to screenshot because you only gotta use like your uh, power button and, like your one of your, like, your volume down buttons. You have to use your power button usually. And I kept on turning my phone off and I turned it off like three times and at that point like I tried to turn my phone back on for like the third time, but the game just uh had uh closed at that point. But um yeah, that's what we end up getting from the repack. We got that Ruby Jar card. So I'm pretty sure he's not even in the store, so I don't think it's possible for me to have gotten him without um what's saying getting him from there, of course, from the draft board. So yeah, I don't even think he's in the store. But um yeah, we got that Ruby Jordan card. And what I want to talk about, though, as you see, this uh, power of this card, 29-24, you're able to get up to Onyx event cards from the draft board. So, as you see, Ruby Jordan Clarkson right here that we just got for free from that um, pack right there is already higher than Jason Tatum. And he's, he's been upgraded a bit. So, 
he's already higher than the foundation Jason Tatum. So, like, these, uh, what's saying, these Ruby cards are going to be really big for upgrading our team, especially early on. All Until we get, like, Onyx, which, like, Onyx, like, cards, like, they, like, get, like, 78, 24 power. Um, and then if we go over to, like, the collection stuff real quick, there's two things I'm going to go over, actually, now that I remember the other one. But if we go over to the collection thing real quick, we uh, filter out pink diamonds. Um, as far as we're going to show down the foundation, it's obviously not the event card because the event card, the point is the event cards are way higher than the, um, foundation cards as you guys are seeing even now with like, um, the event cards that are coming out right now. But as you see, these are like 14 K. So we get, we get up like around the cards, like diamond foundation cards from the draft board without any upgrades. And while we're still getting like, we can get like a Ruby card while, and we're also getting other Ruby cards. So like Ruby card is going to pop up pretty often from the board. That's obviously like our lowest tier right now. If you guys understand what I'm saying, they're going to be a lot easier to acquire than a bunch of Amethyst cards for the time being. But, yeah, that's also what I to get into. Also, we have this Quartzite Pass right here. We're going to be trying to level up in this Quartzite Pass. We have 4 days and 20 hours left, so about the same time we have for the monthly thing. We're going to be trying to get all the way to the end here, and then we'll be able to guarantee ourselves a Diamond card if we are able to do that. But if not, at the very least, get ourselves some coins, get at least this from here, maybe, and get ourselves a chance at that Topaz card. It's a 4% chance, not the craziest. Um, chance you know, I might have a chance to get that as well. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and play through the tourneys, and I'll be right back once something else does it happen. So we are back, and of course, as I was saying, um, we're gonna be getting these Ruby event cards from the draft board, so it's gonna be pretty easy to upgrade up to um the next tier with how we're getting these cards. So as you see, we get those cards right there. Jordan Parker is actually a point guard. I thought he was a shooting guard for whatever reason. Um, but yeah, we got Dejounte Murray, and then we got uh Bill Russell, and we got somebody else. Who, do, who else did we get? I forget. Um, but the point is, we got some more cards. We got Lamella Ball. We got 28 12. Uh, is he lower? Yeah, he's lower base probably Jordan Clarkson. We're going to keep Jordan Clarkson in there. Our, for right now, our goal is to just power up and um, move on to the next tier, which we already have done, right? Um, yeah, we could, uh, go ahead and start playing through Amethyst. What do we need for Onyx? So for Onyx, we need 3,500. And we're getting pretty close already. So we're going to go ahead and move on into the Amethyst tourneys. What is this in my um store that's like an exclamation mark? I have no clue what that is. Um, oh. It's just this. Okay. Uh, may, might be able to get to this event. Might be able to do a, a little bit of something. Might not be able to do crazy, but like first war might be perfectly viable um, if we are able to get to this quickly enough. So, yeah. We're going to go ahead and start playing through these Amethyst tourneys. All right. So, we are back. And the reason why we're back is I think we're good enough to get our 150 coins right now because we have the Quartzite thing. And I'm pretty sure we just finished, like, because they're, like, a, what's saying? We have to, like, a whole bunch of rings. Now, you see, from the board right there, I don't remember who we got. Um, I should have said it before you cleared the screen. Let's go over to my cards. We got... Um, CJ McCullum from that right there. We got Carling Towns a little bit earlier. I'm going to show a screenshot from the last one on the screen right now. But, yeah, we got CJ McCullum right there, who is, our, of course, our highest card now. We got the Bam right there. We got 20 people from the last one. We got Wilt just now. We got Christian Wood right there. I think we got Eric Bledsoe on the previous one. But all these cards that say new are new cards that you guys are technically seeing right now. Which is, let's go ahead over to our team. Let's go to Autofill. And that throws CJ McCullum in there. We still don't have a replacement for either our small forward or our power forward. But... We are now at 2,900 power, and, um, yeah, I understand we should be pretty close to getting, yeah, so we got this, uh, we have this one right here, which isn't going to be what it does, what does it for us, but we have this right here, we get the 25 coins right there, and then we also have the quartzite thing up here, of course, we're not going to be buying the quartzite, but we have the, do have this free version, which is the 25 coins as well, and then all we would have to do now is to link our account, which is some where i'll just have to I'll just link our account right here so yeah i'm going to link my account okay. now that we already did that so we now have an account linked and of course that's going to give us our 100 coins we're going to go ahead and claim this and then of course we already went over it we're going to go ahead and open up that pack in the store which is going to give us a guaranteed diamond which is going to help our team definitely at the very least get to the 3500 so it's going to be a pretty big boost for us right now we do have a uh five percent we have a decent chance of getting um one of these cards what is it? galaxy yeah galaxy opal cards um, right there. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and open it. If we honestly, if I get a diamond, I'm low-key disappointed. Uh, let's go ahead and check this out. See what we're gonna get. And eh, I'm disappointed. Um, we get ourselves a diamond card. Um, I might come back and open up that pack because we do have a chance again some of these cards up here. Assuming we get more coins, because um, I don't really see how we're gonna get the coins. Cause well, maybe I don't know. It's like we, we might be able to get some of this stuff. So we got 25. Um, we got like 100 coins. Right. Well, only 75 actually, because we're not gonna be able to complete all the weekly ones. And the monthly one so yeah we might be able to get it again we'll check it out later on but that of course does put our team up higher and throws johnson which johnson is a pretty good car so i'm not too mad at getting him go ahead and train him up 
as well. And that also, I messed up the training. That also unlocks the event for us. Um, so we can now get ourselves a diamond card. Okay. Um, I hate how the events are like this now. Um, this is why I'm happy that we started today. Because, like, before, like, it would just be like the DeAndre Hunter. That's right there at the end. But um, now, how they have it, they have the diamond card at the end. Um, at the beginning, I should say. But, um, yeah, we're going to go ahead jump back into this um we're gonna just change out of this and then it seems like for this we need 5200 so what i'm going to actually do instead of doing that is i'm going to start playing the power cap event and then we're going to try to get up to 5200 from this um 4k um points right here so we don't have to use our stamina because we are trying to conserve our stamina as much as possible right now so we can continue grind attorney so i'm going to wait um i'm trying to try to wait until we get up to the uh, diamond one but if we don't get up to it before like my stamina refills then i'm going to go ahead and move on to that but yeah i'm going to go ahead and play this and i'll be right back all right, so we're back. Um, basically, what ended up happening off camera, we ended up playing an M50 Adams and a Ruby Kawhi Leonard, and we're still just like, you know, we're just playing through um, the power cap event. Also, this event gives you like some recharge at the beginning, which is gonna be pretty useful. Um, and then there's another thing that I want to say. So basically, in this event, I'm pretty sure you can get like a collectible from the uh, team. I want to check out the real quick. Can we scroll this down? Okay, so no, we can't. So I don't know what's going on, but that's what I'm talking about. Right there, we got that net, net cutters collectible. But it's going to be really hard to take screenshots. I don't know why. My phone is just not taking screenshots. As you see, when we pull this down, that makes that uh, screen disappear. So I don't know. We're going to have to figure something out so we make sure we're able to take screenshots. But um, we do get that net cutters collectible right there, which is pretty big. And if you don't know why that's pretty big, let's go over to our, um, let's, not our collection. Let's go over to the catalog. And we can actually craft ourselves a car right here, as you can see. Um, craft either a deandre hunter or a montrez harrell um right here as you can see um honestly um what i'm thinking we're gonna craft is this montrez harrell the reason for that being if we go over to uh the attorneys the way attorneys work um we're gonna why is what just change this right now the way attorneys work is you get a point guard from the round one you get a shooting guard from round two and then goes all on and on and then you get a center from uh the uh la the final round basically so basically what i'm thinking um which is you know pretty colossal right on my part, I'm not gonna lie. Pretty colossal brand if I do say so myself. But um we're gonna get a center last. So like if we don't get our car, like if we get a small board, then there's like for the third round, that's gonna be a player that we just don't use for a while. Cause I doubt that we're gonna be able to re replace the um wait, is Giles Dribbles? Giles Dribbles is it Giles Dribbles? I'm not completely sure. I doubt we're gonna be able to replace this car on our team very quickly. So I think our best bet is just get a center and then um um have our power upgrade from there. right? Go ahead, craft this Montrez Hero. I've never played with Montrez Hero in this game before. His stats don't look that bad. Strength, rebounding, lame dunks, all out of five. Defense actually pretty decently out of four. And pretty, I, I'm pretty sure he can run the floor pretty well, I would assume so. But unfortunately, it does upgrade our uh, opponents a lot higher. And honestly, I might just stop playing this event once we get to these gear keys because um, I don't think, like, the pink diamond card, I don't think we're about to really use that like that. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and change this. We probably should have waited um, until... We got farther on, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and hop into pink diamond tourneys. So you see, um, getting that card, throw us into pink diamond tourneys, and honestly, let's go ahead and auto for our team real quick. Let's go ahead and train him up. Let's see what uh power he can get to. Should we use these cards right here? I don't see me using these cards, so we're gonna go ahead and auto fill him with these cards as well. Yeah, is that yeah? Okay, we're gonna do that. Um, we're gonna auto fill him with those cards as well. That 52,581, and then what is the next power that we need? So the next power we need is 20k. To be able to upgrade a team. If I would have known that, I wouldn't have just upgraded those uh cards right there until or wanna train those cards away right there into that Montrez Hero. But Montrez Hero is gonna be our team for a very long time um because of what he can do. Also, I wanna check um this over here. So if we go over to the leaderboard real quick, because usually at the end the end of the event, you can get this uh collectible. So what do we need to be able to get that collectible? Because if we can, I would also like to get that DeAndre Hunter. So we would need a uh, 50 600 and we're on pace we're on, on decent pace to be able to get that so we're going to be trying to do that as well let's go to swap montrez hero into here so that our power is way too high now um for this event um and he's he's gonna just like a 20 percent boost crop so i kind of want to use him but unfortunately it doesn't look like we can but the thing about that is like if we swap him in like we're like so much lower so we got to figure something out here so we got to throw montrez into there okay, apparently got to swap Giannis out which is kind of a problem because Giannis is like our best player and then we go lower for Kawhi. She's gonna train those cards away just now. Um, we go lower for Tatum, and then 
yeah i shouldn't train those cards away just now so basically what we're going to do instead is i'm going to go ahead and hop back into the tournaments hopefully get some cards from the board that we can throw into our team because we literally cannot play this event on the um last one and then if we play it on like the one before we're still going up against these um way higher teams um for the time being so you see um we're at 4200 and we're going to be the team that's like 13,484 i don't think we could win that consistently so what i'm going to do instead is i'm going to go ahead back into the tourneys i'm going to uh, play through this and then we'll also play like drills and then apparently we can play head to head set now so we'll go ahead and do that as well so yeah i'm going to go ahead and basically do all the other things right now instead of playing the event and then we'll come back and play the event once we get some cards we can swap into there and um not have to play against teams that are like 12,000 with like a 5k power team so yeah I'll be back once we're able to do some more stuff with our team and get some more cards. We are back. And while we are going, of course, some things did end up happening. We managed to pull ourselves two pink diamond cards on two separate occasions. So, and that's this is all while we were playing through the um, pink diamond tourney. So we're about to finish this in uh, the next quarter. We just have to wait for our salmon to refill. So we end up getting ourselves a pink diamond Tony Parker, as you guys are seeing on the screen, or at least as you should be seeing on the screen. It's not put right there. I, I definitely should have. But pink diamond Tony Parker and a pink diamond david robinson right here if we go over to our cards you see these are our uh cards right here we got Dave robinson and we got tony parker um i was hoping that uh getting Dave robinson would allow me to like play like a lineup that looks like this where we have uh basically Dave robinson Giannis in there and then um we just fill out the rest of the lineup but he lowers our power way too much so we got to get um some lower cards in here assuming he wants to play this so as you see we also got this uh Carl Malone card. We got him from either the draft or from a draft pick. Regardless, I'm pretty sure I screenshot it. So you guys are gonna see it on your screen right now as well. We managed to get some other cards like this Tim Duncan. Um, I don't remember me getting this bound. I don't know where he came from. <clears throat> um, but if I if something I got him at some point, definitely should have screenshot him. And then some of these lower cards that we end up getting. We're hoping for some lower cards right and now. As you can see, um, this team isn't good enough. It's actually like 200 power higher than what it needs to be. So we would need to um get some lower cards i'm really hoping to replace the cd mccomb because he's not really doing anything offensively and he's like really like hurting me head to head like his defense is like atrocious and his like offense isn't really there at least like we, we like play with Dejounte in head to head he's doing something um as far as like on the defensive end he's uh pretty decently fast as well cd mccomb is out there um Kawhi Leonard has played really well um so i've been happy with his performance but we're looking for some more um a shooting guard player uh, we're looking for a shooting guard that can play behind cd mccomb that's a lower power so we can uh, swap them in right there instead of having him there because we can't do anything right now with the team that we have because this they are like all our lower cards and we want to get up to here. So I'm going to go ahead and play through this real quick. And I'll be right back with the card that I'm getting from our, technically our first pink diamond uh, tourney, our first pink diamond tourney round. So yeah, I'll be back. We just finished that quarter. Honestly, I haven't played like a single like minute of gameplay because I've been able to auto the whole time. So that's been helping a lot so i don't have to like just like stare at my phone or be on the game actively but it's pretty sure at some point as we progress we're gonna have to start playing games manually because obviously my ai isn't really that strong but right there we got still the steve francis which honestly i don't think that really helps us like at all for being 100 honest um what i think that we could do is upgrade tony parker so my uh point guard is higher so we could throw a lower a uh, higher point guard in there um right so we can play through this because we need to lower our power and if we upgrade somebody else then this should uh, go up as well and then like this team might be applicable to, for us to be able to use but i kind of want to keep day robinson because i feel like day robinson is like a really good card um and we don't have to do it right now so i think we're gonna hold off on that for a bit i think what i'm gonna do is hop into the drills and see if we get like a shooting guard or something we need a shooting guard to be honest um i don't want to have to rush to do anything let's see let's claim some of this stuff can we um do anything with our coins if we claim all of them up right there we got 87 we got 137 how do we get a odd number of coins how's that oh from the free pack okay um we have 147 coins honestly i'm thinking that we might have to go back to um open up this pack in the store over here i'm not sure if that makes the most sense though because um like but honestly we should be able to pull like the galaxy opal cards that are up here but we last time we pulled a diamond card like honestly if we don't pull Jonas right there this uh we'd be a lot farther but um it is what it is um is there anything else that we can do um 
with our coins. Yeah, it looks like that's the only option. It's considering how little coins that we have right now. So I think we might have saved them. And we'll just uh check back in if anything else doesn't happening. Um I wanna go back to playing head to head. Um I stopped playing because I was hoping like at some point we had a new shooting guard, but like me trading away all my cards, I definitely shouldn't have traded away all my cards into this monster so I should have just waited a bit. But um we need a new shooting guard because City McCum is not good. Alright, so we are back. Now I'm just now realizing this video is like 20 minutes long. So I actually want to end it right here with this section. So basically, what I'm happening all three, nothing really crazy actually happened, I'm pretty sure. Um, but something important did end up happening. So let's go look at our collection real quick. I'm just making sure just to scroll through. So yeah, we didn't really end up getting any new cards that were like upgrading our team type of cards. We got cards that are valuable to our team type of cards, if you know what I'm saying. So basically what happened happening, we managed to get ourselves this Damien Lillard right here. We managed to get ourselves this Tyler here. Basically what that means that we can now go into here and we can play through um the power cap event with this team right here so we've been able to win a couple of games well we we won one game and we tied twice and i, I was like literally on two times i was like feeling confident after we won and then we use our doublers both of them and then we have one more because i just watched the ad for it but um yeah it's basically what was happening and now we are at a uh, four thousand um points so let's go, go in here claim this diamond car and it's going to be a diamond pj washington which is pretty high um power car um can not throw Giannis in there which is interesting um i want to tyler hero i don't know I, i'm not I'm still not really happy with like my shooting guard position but we now we can throw Giannis in there only problem is Montrez hero like Montrez hero is like way too undersized to be in the game but like we kind of have to use him for, we're off use for a while too which kind of sucks but uh we do get pj washington right there pretty um a big upgrade i'm not gonna lie um let's go ahead train him up as well and he's going to be at 23 100 power and if we go back into here can we um add the team anymore i guess we don't really want to do that any more edits to this team because we do have damon there already so yeah we'll keep i probably shouldn't have trained him at all to be honest um so um at the end of this video let's go ahead and check out our rewards here we're at 19,449 power we're actually pretty close to being able to um get to that 20k power mark and i think i want to do that before i play any more pink diamond games so Probably in the next video, we're definitely going to end up reaching that. I'm going to play some more head-to-head -head and then try to get uh, some more players uh, for that. Um, this was a team that we were using because we had to get, like, three-point shots at the power force. We were trying to get – that's why we had Larry Markin in at the power force position right there. But, yeah, um, that's basically going to be the end of the video. Um, let me know in the comments how you guys' progress on your account is going. Um, we should have episode two. They should be dropping daily, at least the first couple episodes um, because we have, like, a lot of upgrades to make in the beginning. And I don't want the videos to be like an hour long. So, yeah, episode two should be coming out uh, tomorrow. And, yeah, if you guys did enjoy the video, drop a like. Subscribe if you guys are new. And peace out.